can you share with us a moment that maybe wasn't your best self as a mom, as a new mom? Do you have, you, do you have a bad or what we like to call an awesome moment of something that you did <laughs> that uh, you maybe don't want to, sh- you know, you're like, oh, that just happened. And I'm not going to, uh, I'm not going to tell anyone about it. Or just like, who am I? I don't know who I am anymore. Why did I do this? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, Jack fell off the bed more times than he should have, for sure. <laughs> So, so but, more than once, more than zero times yeah. then. <laughs> yeah, usually you learn your lesson the first time, but I think it was like, tw- I think it was the second time. This, yes. So our bed is ridiculously high. Literally when I got pregnant, I had to convince my husband that we needed to remove the box springs and put bunky boards, which are just those really thin things. Because post C-section, I can't get up and down. Mm-hmm. Like, well, I'm mine too, but the bed is about here. So it's like a <laughs> to get up on it. So it's not a small fall. And Jack hadn't learned how to roll over. You know, it's like, oh, they rolled over for the first time or they yeah. opened the door for the first time. And so I set him on the bed and my closet is three feet from the side of the bed. And I was just in the closet getting a shirt and turned around and it was like slow motion happening. Oh. Like, oh, it's the yeah. worst. <laughs> And I shouldn't be laughing. Rightfully so, my husband was like, well, why did you leave him there? I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. Stupid. I'm um, doing the best I can. He didn't know how to roll. I yeah. thought he was just going to lay there. <laughs> he was just going to say what? Um, so, yeah, there's... Uh, but also, one of my more, like, that I get judged for, but I feel like a shining mom moment, um, I let Jack learn how to use the stairs really early. And even, God, it must have been, like, it was in the last few months I did a podcast and he was crawling up and down the stairs behind me and they were like, you can do that. And we had we have two steps in our back hallway that he would go up and down and practice from the time he could crawl. And then I removed the gates from the stairs and you know, my husband's panicking. I'm like, he will figure this out. I promise. And I put the dog bed at the base of the stairs and he climbed up to like the third step and then fell down. Did that twice. And he has never fallen since then. But he uh, fell into the dog bed. That's genius. That is really yeah. so talk about a mom. <laughs> Yeah, like For it was uncomfortable, but there was no blood. So that's that's very much my like parenting style. Like learn, like you can get hurt. I'm not going to let you get hit by a car, but like right. you will learn through experiences. And although, you know, uh, we would love to tell people like, oh, this happened to me. Don't do this. That doesn't work. It's like, oh, that guy did X, Y, Z. Like, don't, don't do that. Yeah. I would do that. You're never going to listen. You're right. going to, whatever horrible thing is going to happen. And you're going to be like, oh, you were right. So well, especially that, kids think, that's got the genes of your mom in them. You can't tell them that at yeah, all. You can't tell them what to do. <laughs> You'd be like, no. definitely do heroin. It's Define so amazing. It. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You for for sure it. jump out of that airplane. It's great. 